What is Cumex gas composition? It's an interface that will allow you to manually or uh, through an automated process adjust to compositions that change in the field. Say you have a flare gas that's changing over time. We know that for thermal meters the composition affects the output of that meter. So as, if your composition changes over time, you had it calibrated for one mixture, now you've got a different mixture, the output of the meter will be different and that can cause inaccuracy. So how do we address that? We have Qmix. Qmix allows you to make gas mixtures, apply them to the meter, and then keep that accuracy as your, as your mixture changes. So um, with Qmix, there's a couple scenarios on how you might get that. You could purchase it up front with the meter. You know you, you're going to use that meter out there in the field with changing flare gases or something like that. So you're going to purchase it up front with the meter, and then it'll be activated at the factory. You'll get the meter. You'll be able to use Qmix immediately. No, no easy access. Um, if you purchase Qmix in the field, say you've already got a 640i, 780i out there, or you purchase a new one and you don't know at that point you want to use Qmix, but later on you decide to, how, how can you then get access to the Qmix interface? This is what I'll show you right now. Say that's the situation we're in. We're in the field. We've got a meter that we either had from before, or we've got a meter that we just purchased, but it's not activated, and we want to make it active with Qmix. How do we do that? You click the Qmix activation bu button. So it pops up a little message here and it says, call our customer support team. They'll lead you through the process of creating a Sierra account. Once you have that account, they will take your credit card information. They will purchase the Qmix for you. They will provide you with an activation code. And then that activation code will be put into this interface right here. So for this meter, I got an activation code. And now all you have to do is click start Qmix. You would be getting this from our, our customer support team and it opens up the Qmix interface. Okay, what do we see here? Qmix gas composition. What does Qmix gas composition allow you to do? We're gonna mix, make mixtures that reflect the changes we see in our pipe. And then we're gonna apply them to the meter, and the meter will then automatically account for that change and be more accurate. What do we have to mix with? We've got over 120 pure gases that you can mix with, starting with just some basic common gases, hydrocarbons, and then going all, all into refrigerants, there's different kinds of gases, uh, hydrogen sulfide, maybe you want to mix from, from the big list. But all these can be used as components and mixed up together. So uh, let me just do a little example here. We're going to make a flare mix. You'll use some, a little bit of methane, some nitrogen, some propane, and then some CO2. So that's uh, just a generic a flare mixture. Uh, we're going to pick a basis. It's going to be volume, and we're going to say flare gas. Generate our mixture. Okay, it's been created. It's been saved onto our, our laptop here, into our gas library. So now it's available for upload to the meter. So at that point, what you would do if you want to put it on the meter is just select it, click your upload button, select from the available gas slots to put a gas into. I'm just going to put it into slot two here. If you've had some uh, gases that were installed at the factory that you want to save, this gives you the ability to just save that file for later. I'm not going to do that at this point. Okay, what's happening now is you've got that gas file that we just created is being loaded to the meter. It takes it a few seconds to do so, but once it's done, the meter is now reading more accurately than it was before because it is taking your true composition into account when it's reading the flow. So we're, we're loading is nearly complete here. We're just going to wait a second. And once that, that loading is complete, you have a, 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 a new accuracy for your meter. So that's the process of creating a gas, loading it. You have a few more features here that are potential. Say you had a, a composition that didn't quite total to 100%. You could hit normalize, and it'll, it'll equally um, normalize each of the components to make it 100%. Um, say you were using a hydrocarbon mixture. Um, we have the ability to use AGA8 data in our development of that hydrocarbon mixture, so if you want to use the increased accuracy for hydrocarbons that AGA8 can provide, you just click that button there, and it'll use AGA8 when it creates your mix. So it's pretty simple. You can make up the mix, you can load it into the meter, the meter is now adjusted for the changing composition. It's a very powerful feature. 
one that um, if you're having your meter sampled or your, your pipeline sampled every six months or something, you would use an interface like this to uh, manually interact with the meter and uh, adjust it. This, this prevents you from having to come back later and apply correction factors to data that's been captured or, or um, other things that, that you have to do like that to account for this because we know that uh, the EPA and others uh, want everything to be accounted for and they want it to be as accurate as possible. So using this, it gives you a, a tool to make that happen without having to send your meter back to the factory for recalibration, without having to uh, jump through hoops after the fact using correction factors. You can do it at the time your change happens. We've even got this available where you can do it real time if you have a gas chromatograph or another type of sampling device that can be read on a, a interval. We, we can push these changes to the meter based on that and you have the power of a real-time correction to your, your, um, your accuracy. So that's the power of QMix. This is how you get it. Uh, if you had activated the factory, it would be just like this. You wouldn't have had to even go through any activation steps. You just go right into using it. If you activate it in the field, it's just as simple as we just did it. A simple call to our, our um, customer specialists. They help you get activated and then you're on your, on, ready to go. And once you get a meter activated, you can then from any other um, laptop or PC that you have connected to the meter, you'll be able to use QMix on that meter then. This is a by the meter activation. So uh, that's, that's QMix. That's the um, improvements we've made to it. We, we've had it out there a little while for beta to do some learning, have people use it. It's had some great response from, and feedback from the world. Um, and we've made some uh, advances to it. And we're pushing it back out to you to, to enjoy and, and see the improvements that, that you can have in your system using QMix. Thank you.